How's my hair? <laughs> Better than our running picks. <laughs> yeah, no shit. Um, first off, thank you, Sarah, for uh, filming this. Shout out to my beautiful wife. Yeah, you're welcome. Um, so what I'm going to do right now is kind of show you some subframing techniques that I use. Um, and I usually use it with wider angle lenses. Today I'm using the 13 millimeter from Viltrox, which is a really cool lens. Um, I'll link it in the description below if you want to purchase one. Um, but subframing is whenever you're looking through an object to take a picture of your subject. And I do this quite often with a lot of my images and it helps bring them to life. The composition's a lot better. Uh, and it's just something I kind of get used to doing. So I want to show you how I do it. And that's what we're about to do. Thank you. <laughs> Perfect, though, boy. Yes, like right there. So I'm just gonna let you kind of move around. Yeah. And just have fun for a second. Good. Would you step this way? A few steps. Keep going. Like uh, about a few feet. Right Thank there. You. All right. All right. Just real quick, I'm gonna get a silhouette of you. So okay. I'm look out to your right. A little bit further. All right. This time, I want you to have like you have your right arm in the air. <laughs> Maybe some of the city in the background here, so they're gonna yeah. be kind of small in the frame. Oh, it's great. I like the hands where they're at. Yeah. Right. These two posts because they're actually the same size. This concrete block throwing me off a little bit. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take this three different ways. Okay. One from down low. I like how your stance is right now. And one from up high. <laughs> we should do something like uh, a big step from the middle to here. You know what I mean? Like just like something like kind of like over. Like oh, okay. Yeah. Like. All right. Let's actually do the movement here. I saw the square from downstairs earlier. <laughs> and uh, I think it would look really cool to do a silhouette here of Brian and um, and see how it goes. Uh, but it's just to go, it goes to show like how little things can turn into like a really good place to shoot. So we're gonna jump in and see how they go. Do this in two different ways. One's just gonna be like this way, straight face, chin up, you know, like perfect posture, all right? Dead center. And I'll have you step to your right, my way, a few steps. It's right there, that's what that Alright, so don't move from that. Let me go from there. That was one more like that. I'm gonna do one from a little further back. That one's great. Let's get your left arm, just kind of have it out like this. Yeah, I love that. That's great. Let's get 
looks like we took the handle that chimney over there. Oh. <laughs> 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 like the leaning tower. <laughs> 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 Alright, so yeah, let's like actually like kind of lean in and out here okay. so we can tell how high we really are. It's like that right there. That's good. And let's have your chin up here towards me. Alright, let's get that hand to kind of reach out towards the camera a little more. Oh, great, man. Come out a little further. All right, let's get your head back towards the wall. There we go. I don't recommend leaning off buildings <laughs> to any of you kids out there. All right, that's just like you are. I'm gonna give a shot like this. This light looks great on you. Yeah, so that's what I wanted to use. Okay, so right here, as you can see, we have a set of stairs, which is really nice because you have all these bars, and those are leading lines. I'm sure you know what a leading line is, but it's really nice to have those implemented in your photos. Um, so what I'm gonna do is use those leading lines and shoot through them. So I'll probably shoot straight through here, and Brian's gonna be coming around down the bottom side, and you'll see that picture right after this. Brian, the bag, let's get your bag. You know, sure. It kind of look like you're going somewhere. Yeah. Um, and we'll just have it in your left hand as an afterthought, and the logo be pointed out that way. If we can do that. Yeah. Take a few steps and let me just see what it's going to look like. Yeah. All right, we're going to do that one more time, but I want you to look up towards the camera. Okay. And don't fall. <laughs> All right? Yeah. Yep. All right, now I want to do one of you standing in that corner over there real quick. Right here? Yeah, like in the very corner corner. So have you lean into the corner where your hand can touch the oh, corner there? Yes. Perfect. I'm going to have you look out towards the sun. It's not too bright. Love it. All right, stay there for a second. Sarah, I'm going to have you set the camera down. I'm going to have you in this picture. I'm going to have you run up these stairs. All right, so I'm changing lenses. Obviously. Um, right now to get a little bit closer up to Brian because we haven't got any close-ups of him and I know this 28 millimeter equivalent 18 uh, is not the best thing for close-ups because it distorts a little bit so you have to be careful getting close to your subject so you don't get any distortion. So they're going to be kind of like semi close-ups uh, but he has this really cool shirt that we're going to test out and see how it goes and we're going to do it right here because we've got these winds blowing the, the leaves everywhere and I think it's going to look really cool. I'm just going to kind of get you like this. And then kind of lean back a little yeah. bit. Yeah, this is looking sharp right here. Awesome. I said close up, here we are over here, get pulled by it. <laughs> a little bit more left, almost uncomfortably, and then keep your eyes back to like the ball. There you go. Keep running, and then uh, we'll get some more out in this area. Yeah. Yeah. I kind of like. Yeah. That looks good right there. Perfect. Obviously, I'm not sub framing here. All right, that looks good right there. Love that. We'll come up a little bit closer. You can get a strong cut. That's awesome. That's good. All right, so I want you with this hand to come across to this side of the shirt. Nice. Kind of pull it over for no like reason. That? Yeah, just like that. Yeah. Your line's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Let me borrow it. Right. Don't reach your bag. <laughs> Look at you guys. I'm changing lenses back to the 13 millimeter, 20 millimeter equivalent. 
Um, so what I saw earlier while I was walking around uh, are these, whatever these are. You may know what they are if you do, comment. <laughs> what is this, for bikes or something? What is this? I'd assume it's a you no know, car show up here, I don't know. I don't know, but they're circles, right? So I was thinking if I had somebody standing right here, and I was over here, using this as a subframe, it would look really cool. Film user and most other cameras, Sony's doesn't get this small, but this one, if you see, can you focus on that? You can make the, the square very small. You see how small it is? Anyway, so I'll make this as small as I possibly can, right? So I see this bench and I see all these cool little diamond shapes. And what I want Brian to do is come over here and our light's coming from this way. So I'm just gonna have you like stand like this right here. Yeah. And you'll be looking towards this window. Okay. Sure. So what I want to do is shoot from the bottom up towards you through all these. And that looks really cool. We got some really cool patterns. And I want you to kind of let's mess with the shirt on the right side a little bit. On this side? Yeah. Yeah. I might have a seat on this. Right there, right there. Yeah. That's yeah. great. Nice. That's gonna have to be like, maybe you're just like standing up looking down at it. Okay. So you can stand like right here. One of these is gonna turn out worse. Just some more light on you. But like, while you're looking out to the left, tilt the head towards the camera. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. 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 I can you should have come with these on the spot you like. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, <laughs> I just walk I around saw it. Um, yeah. All right, so another thing, this is, these are two other places that I found when I was just walking around looking. Um, these benches right here, you can probably already tell where I'm going with this. And I kind of want you like this right here. And you can kind of like lean into yourself a little bit. Just kind of look out this way, all right? Yeah. All right. And I'm going to use this as a subframe so I can shoot through here. And I'm going to get four reflections probably, if I had to guess. I'm going to try this. I'll try this one more time through here if I can just shoot. Okay, trash can. <laughs> <laughs> this is not just a trash can. All right, this is gonna be great. We have the sun coming towards you. I'm gonna use this as a subframe as well. Oh, that moves. Even better. So I'm gonna be shooting through that hole right there, okay? But you're gonna be on this side. Oh, okay. okay? Um, and we're gonna just kind of like do some, I want you to do some more of those movements that you were doing earlier. Yeah. Uh, I would really like something kind of like limp a little bit. Yeah. You know I mean? A little, okay. little fun. Ooh, that smells. Yeah, it smells really bad. I'll take one of the garbage can or thing. <laughs> <laughs> the real star of this production. Yeah. Biggest option got closed down for some reason. I don't know. Somebody peed in the pool. Somebody peed in the pool. Uh, so we have all this bamboo here, and um, I'm gonna shoot Brian right up against the bamboo, but then I'm gonna use this to subframe him, this chair. But we're gonna start here first. Thanks. Oh, it's good. Can I move around with you a little bit? 
Alright, eyes here. That's good. I'll get down below you. Eyes. Eyes towards there real quick. Give the other camera some love. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, now I'm gonna step over here and use this as a subframe. Hopefully. Okay, can I introduce you or absolutely introduce you? What, yeah. do you call yeah, right. what do you call that? <laughs> so, well, he didn't say his name, it's self introduction. Um, so real quick, um, I'd like to thank Brian Armstrong yes. for modeling today. He did awesome. Thanks for having me. Yeah, um, do you have any of your favorites off the top of your head that you think are going to be your favorites? I mean, I like to say that I like all of them because they're all very different than what I'm used to. Yeah, that's good. Um, yeah, man. Parking garage is cool. Yeah. The stairs. Yeah. I love the stairs with the sunlight coming in. Yeah, the movement. Oh, cool. yeah. yeah. That's good. And then around here, you know, the, the got the beach vibes yeah. going over. We got, shirt, we got, yeah, you know, I got to. <laughs> well, yeah, I, I really love it. I appreciate you coming, man. Yeah. yeah. Thanks for having me. You guys are awesome. Yeah, man. Yeah. We'll Sweet. do it again. Yeah. Peace. <laughs> A round of applause for Sarah. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> do something cool. There we go. <laughs>